Welcome to Chapter 3 of our story, where the heart of the village beats with an ancient rhythm. The cobblestones glisten with the remnants of the earlier rain, and the air is thick with tension. Flickering holograms cast ghostly shadows upon the ancient stone structures, illuminating the faces of the villagers. Their expressions are a mix of fear and anticipation. Join us as we delve into this tale of mystery and heritage, where the past and present collide in a dance of shadows and light. Stay tuned as we unravel the secrets that bind this village together. In the heart of the village, where cobblestones glisten with the remnants of rain, a young girl with vibrant blue hair stands amidst her friends. The air is thick with tension, and the scent of damp earth fills the square. A gust of wind sweeps through, carrying whispers of the past. The spirit, a manifestation of shadows and light, hovers ominously, its glowing eyes piercing through the veil of uncertainty. The girl feels a shiver run down her spine, a primal instinct urging her to flee, yet she remains rooted compelled by the weight of her heritage. This is a moment of reckoning, where the past and present intertwine, and the spirit seeks recognition and healing. Beside the girl with blue hair stands another, her long black hair flowing like a dark river. Her warm brown eyes reflect the swirling mist that begins to coalesce in the center of the square. The spirit, a manifestation of shadows and light, hovers ominously, its glowing eyes piercing through the veil of uncertainty. The girl feels a shiver run down her spine, a primal instinct urging her to flee, yet she remains rooted, compelled by the weight of her heritage. This is a moment of reckoning, where the past and present intertwine, and the spirit seeks recognition and healing. The village historian, a man with a weathered face, steps forward with determination. Despite the chaos around them, his voice is steady. He urges the group to confront the spirit together. Nearby, a young man stands slightly apart, his connection to nature palpable as he reaches out to the earth, grounding himself amidst the turmoil. As the spirit lashes out, the ground trembles beneath their feet, and the girl's heart races. Memories of her family's past flood her mind, intertwining with the present. She realizes that the spirit is not merely a harbinger of chaos but a guardian seeking recognition and healing. With newfound resolve, she steps forward, her voice rising above the cacophony.